Tell us about your first, your last name. Uh, Rob Lester, R-O-B, L-E-S-T-E-R. Yeah, talk about where we are. You possibly have someone trapped. Starting with the time and the address, walk me through it. Uh, we're in the city of Anaheim at the inter intersection of Lincoln and Kingsley Avenue. We got a report of a car into a light pole with one person trapped and the vehicle on fire. Uh, we arrived, there was, the vehicle was on fire, but the bystanders had pulled the victim out. Okay, so they pulled him out because it was catching on fire? Correct, yes. Uh, he's en route to a trauma center? He is en route to a local trauma center. So this is a solo vehicle Tesla, right? Yeah, solo vehicle Tesla into a light pole. Okay, well, we don't know if any other uh, vehicles were involved? Or... Uh, as of right now, it doesn't appear any other vehicles were involved. Due to the impact, would you classify him as a trauma? Yeah, due to the impact, we classify him as a trauma. Okay, the area is going to be shut down for PD investigation, right? The area will be shut down for an undetermined amount of time while uh, Anaheim Police Department investigates. How lucky is he? Due to the impact uh, of that driver's area. Yeah, the impact. The driver's area is impacted uh, pretty severely, so he is a lucky man to be uh, be pulled out. Anything else to add? That's it. What'd you see here? I mean, I'm just driving down the road. Next thing I see, really, he could have been trying to dodge something in the road. I'm not too sure, but. He, he swerves off and slams into the, to the, to the street light. And so uh, me and a couple other guys, a lot of people show up at the end, but me and a couple other guys pull our cars over. Um, I don't even know, start throwing stuff at his windows because the car starts, it's, it's on fire. Um, and so break open his windows, pull him out as fast as we can. Um, that's about it really. How fast was he? I think he was going the speed limit. Yeah, uh, it looked like he might have been trying to dodge something in the road. And, um, yeah, I mean, it's just unfortunate, man. It happens. Yeah, so, um, spell your uh, first initial your last name. Uh, my name is Liam Campbell. Spell it for me. L-I-A-M. 
C A M P B E L L. You live local? I do, yeah, I live in Orange. Uh, Dominique Sanchez, D O M I N I Q U E S A N C H E Z. Um, well, I was already sleeping, but I just heard a loud crash. Um, really, it felt like my house shook. So that's what woke me up, and um, I just started seeing the smoke and hearing people trying to break through something. Um, so I thought there was some violence or something, but uh, no, I kept hearing screaming and loud, lots of loud yells, which made me come out. I'm a nurse, so I thought I gotta come out and try to see if I can help. Um, and that's when I saw a group standing around this young gentleman. So you're a nurse? I am. Did you try to help her? Um, I did, yeah. I just, I, you know, we asked him. There's a CNA as well. Uh, she's a CNA, but she was asking, um, you know, his name, trying to keep him alert and oriented, checking him. And, and I bet uh, it's going to be a while until you're going to be able to fall back to sleep huh, with all the action. It sure will, yes. Yeah. So more than anything, just praying for him and hoping that he's going to be okay.